right here and here is another Queen's Beast coin and this is obviously the uh, change checker version because it only cost that much um, as you see it's 2019 Yale of I can't say that Beaufort I think anyway five pound coin so let's uh, check there or just you know go to the Westminster UK okay? and here is the coin very It's like a, I'm not really sure what it is, a ram type of thing, or a goat, or a dog. Yeah, so, to put on my pages, as you see. So, so far, if you haven't seen the videos, we have got the lion. The Unicorn, well, Lion of England, Unicorn of Scotland, Red Dragon of Wales, the Black Bull of Clarence, the Falcon of Plantagenets, and this is the Yale of Beaufort, if that's how you say it. The Yale is a mythical beast with the characters characteristics of an antelope or goat, depending on the imagination of the artist, and their desire to portray grace and elegance or strength and determination. Strangely, it is said to have horns that can turn independently, so in medieval illustrations it is often shown with horns pointing in different directions. The Yale of Beaufort is a symbol of Lady Margaret Beaufort, the mother of Henry the... Yeah, I, I, I had to count that. <laughs> anyway, yeah, there. And as you see, these little slits just pop in here. If you uh, remember from previous videos, I changed from the uh, silver proof to this version because it's easier on my lot. I mainly collect trading cards, not coins, so. Anyway, yes, so I only have four more left to collect, which is the White Lion of Mortimer, the White Horse of Hanover, the White Greyhound of Richmond, and the Griffin of Edward III. So, yeah, so that. Is it so? Look forward to the next four when they come. And um, yes, um, you can DM me on Instagram if you want. I do have a couple of the uh, silver proof one versions of these that I have for sale at their retail price, or maybe I can haggle a tiny bit less, but since basically I've only just taken them out for recording and take pictures, otherwise they stay in their cases, so they're not really handled very much, so they're basically in mint, pristine condition since when I got them. So I do have, uh, for the silverproof coins, I think I have the unicorn, the lion, and a griffin or something. Um, DM me if you're interested in buying them. Uh, the prices I think varied a tiny bit because on some of them I did get them at a discounted price because yeah so I'll sell them at the discounted price I bought them for. So I think one or two of them were like 95 pounds plus postage. Um, one of them I think was 75 plus postage and postage would be um, 
kind of what you wanted, like, uh, like, sign for, tracked, or, a, like, that special delivery, that 1pm thing for Royal Mail. Or I can probably do it by parcel force, which would be more expensive, but we'll see. So DM me on Instagram. And if you want to buy one of them, I'll, you know, send pictures and whatever. I do have a couple other sold proof coins for sale as well, including that diamond set proof, um, queen's, uh, coin that's, you know, that huge, you said five ounce? Was it two ounce? Uh, well, just DM me for pictures, and I will get them to you. And please only serious offers, because I do want to uh, get rid of them, so I can, you know... Yeah, and probably I can set aside some of that to actually get a new laptop or other stuff. Anyway, so yes, so that was it. So, the change tracker versions are, you know, cheaper, so if you're stuck on, you know, some things, it's easier to do a change checker version, because they're not that, that expensive, so the prices will be going up from 3 something to 450 or something soon, so, yeah. So thank you for watching, like and subscribe for more, and the bell for notifications, over and out.